<laughs> it's a bit close. I've got my phone on the holder. Um, so I don't have to hold it. Obviously, what would it be in a holder? And a, oh, music. Well, you get that thing on the, you know, when you YouTube video. What is going on with a friggin' double right. chin, damn it? We are going to the beach. Um, because I'm coming off my medication, again, different type of medication this time because the end goal is to be completely medication free. I have taken <clears throat> two milligrams of diazepam um, just because I don't think I would do it otherwise. Um, so we're going to walk the dogs. And also, um, I want to do zero waste, you know, like so we use plastic free at the same time as I also want to do clean eating and at the same time as I want to do Weight Watchers. And Weight Watchers and clean eating, that's fine, they kind of go hand in hand. It's really easy to do clean eating on Weight Watchers. I like them. But the single use plastic thing is really blooming hard because there's things like, well actually it wouldn't be clean eating, but things like um, if you want to do the no count plan, or hang on, which I like doing, um, you can have as much of this like, low calorie bread that you like, as you like, not that you like, who knows that you like it. <coughs> um, anyway, but you can't obviously do that without using single use plastic and it also wouldn't be clean eating, so that's a nuisance. And it's the same with a lot of breads and things like that. Ordinarily, the dog would never travel like this in the car, but she's just got wind of the fact that we're at the beach and she's crazy excited. Um, I had a freaking huge bout of anxiety on the way here and I really, really wanted to say to Wayne, okay, stop, I can't do this. Turn around, please, we need to go home. Um, oh, I don't really mind. I want to go into the town, please, so here's good. Uh, just get like an hour though in the parking. Do that, I think I might have some change. Let's have a look. I don't know why I don't do this when I'm not vlogging. Um, she's just so excited she can't cope. <laughs> Hang on a minute, I need to see how I change. Uh, oh, I have some. I know she's so excited. 40, 60. I've got 90p. <laughs> 10 minutes parking for 90p. <clears throat> I'm losing my voice. Um, I forgot what I was saying now. My bout of anxiety where I wanted to just turn around and go home. But you know, once you get over that, it's, it is the most horrific feeling if you have anxiety or agoraphobia or generalized anxiety disorder or anything similar. Wait. And then let me show you how difficult it is compared to wait. So desperate to get out, but I told her to wait. Look, she's shaking. Ah, 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 she's shaking. She's so busty. Good girl. Yes. <laughs> Off they go to the beach. And this is why I pushed through the panic. Is there anything more beautiful? Really not comfortable today. Pretty glad that we made it here. 
I can kind of want to go home. Yeah. It's just too difficult. I'm trying to stay with the feeling. But it's really hard. And um, it's like the flight or flight. No, it's not. For fuck's sake. Fight or flight. You know, the surges of adrenaline. I'm going to clean up my dog's poo now. I feel like I can't do it. Um, so I think the plan is to go home. And, or at least go back towards home. <clears throat> I will do this again because I know it's just a side effect of coming off the medication. It's just, it's really difficult. It's all such a horribly uncomfortable feeling. Oh, just the worst feeling. Just want to be home. Oh my gosh, I can't bear it. and remember the techniques to lessen the anxiety. I get hot, I just feel like I want to strip off all my clothes. I can't bear it. Name five brown things that you can see. Ooh, five brown things. Trees, bushes, fences, grass, Lamppost, uh, that posty thingy there. Two things you can smell. They're talking got, about steam trains. Because they've got those bikes that you can go around, oh, and yeah. aerial, all sorts of things at that campsite. But this camp's got the sea on one side of you, and the train track on the other side. So guess what Mike's going to be doing all week? Camera. Steam <laughs> trains. I don't know, but it 